The plan also covers marching band and they're already dealing with a lot. In July, the UIL ruled some schools can't practice in person until September. Right now, everything is all virtual and some schools say after losing more than a month of training, this season will be nearly impossible. Jay Wallace has more. The back parking lot of John Horn High School usually isn't this empty in August. This would have normally been the first full week of band camp, not in 2020. You're talking about a curveball. This has been the nastiest curveball we've ever been thrown. The John Horn Marching Band advanced to the UIL State Marching Contest in 2018. Now they're ready to compete for state again, but with weeks of summer band camp lost due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Hour wise, you know, just, yeah. I, I, I'll have to add that up for you. That's just, I can't even think about it. Now this is so much more than playing music and walking. You have to make sure your marching is the same as everyone around you. And when you stop or turn to the beat, you have to make sure and hit the right spot. And John Horn's not the only band dealing with this problem. We're probably on plan Z now. David Brandon is band director at Duncanville High School, a program that has gone to state every year it's competed in since 1988 and won the whole thing three times. We want to do well and we want to measure ourselves against the very best. Like John Horn, Duncanville couldn't have summer band camp in person and forced Brandon to move his entire show plan for this year to 2021 in exchange for a simpler show that can be learned much quicker. We're gonna be under the gun uh, to get something in place if we start August or September 8th. The band leaders from Central High School and Keller ISD have been sending the students physical training videos to help with the loss of summer workouts. If you're sitting down and you're playing video games and eating Cheetos all day, it's going to be really rough when we can when we kick this thing back up. And if and when that does happen, John Horn's drum major says making sure the new freshmen don't feel overwhelmed will be an important first step. Marching band at its core is like a way to build connections, and so we got to make sure we do that first. And bring back the music to the back parking lot. In Mesquite, I'm Jay Wallace.